I'm gonna fight Helena. I'm gonna hate this so much because I started hating this last bit of the game. I am gonna hate this so much that I might go take a shit on the developer's doorstep. <laughs> the voices are like, I don't want to die. Please stop. Then I was like, fuck you guys. I didn't ask you to be a part of me. If you don't want to die with me, then leave me alone. I don't want to die. Please stop. Please stop. Please stop. Please stop. Please stop. Please stop. What is this? Damn. That's hardcore. The runes I miss, I guess. It knows that true torment lies within memories you cannot defeat, you cannot escape. Or is this Helena speaking to us? She's this like a manager. Is her hell? Is that her mom? The burning? What the fuck? Did her dad burn her mom? I remember it clearly now. She has nothing to fear anymore. The gods have saved your mother. Through my hand. of the underworld. They crawl into your soul and rot you from the inside. <sighs> Defy the gods like your mother and the darkness will come for you too. You understand, son. I was just a child. 
You created this darkness! You created this darkness so you could hide behind it! Oh, Only shit. salvation. It is the way of the gods. That's really freaky. Hona's really... Oh, it was all a lie. Please, don't be a fairy. You are a lie! She didn't defy the gods. She defied you. And so you killed her. You didn't pray to the gods. You prayed to your mother. Your mother, who was too weak to fight the darkness and abandon you. You tortured her. You killed her. It's kind of epic. You are the Those rituals, the years of isolation, the pain that still haunts you. It was the only way to fight the curse within you. Is Sonoma a Helena? Because half of her is decaying while half of her is alive. The darkness is here. You cannot wish it away. And it will watch as you draw the last dying gas. I won't let you kill me! Oh shit. Oh please. Why are you guys so much easier to kill now? Oh what? I totally dodged that. Okay, come on. Come on. I can taste the freedom. The end game's here. Oh wow, these guys are like easy mode right now. Oh shit, I lied. I'm just getting a little too cocky. It's only my voice. Well, Senua's voice. Oh shit. Let's focus on Berserker. Damn it. Watch Oh shit. This is. Why is it so easy? I'm very confused. This is like easier, and I'm not like dying, dying. Oh, that kind of like stunts them all. Oh god, I'm in like an orgy. Oh, come on! Thanks for breaking me out of this damn orgy, fucking assholes. Damn it! Like, you have no time to like defend yourself.
that's it. Damn. I like this music. I can see through your darkness. You're a liar and a murderer. And if you Oh, I feel so. Then I have a like tense. That can kill a god. She like breaking up stuff. What you doing? Stare to her. You're making a mistake searching for Gideon. The same mistake that killed him in the first place. I tried to save you from yourself. You saw them that is a lie. The plague of darkness, the butchering of Gideon by the Norsemen. You saw it yourself. Cursed. They believed you. I believed you. Tell me, Senua. Helena's just sitting here chilling while she has like a mental breakdown. How you saved them? He's here. I know he's here. Jesus. Cillian, I know you're here. Hold on. Oh, 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 not this thing again. Don't have me fight other things with this thing. I hated this god. Ah, oh, damn it. Not cool. Why are you giving me more gods? Jesus, you come on. Dodge that. That's cheating. All these fucks are cheating. Alright. Come on! I hate this. I knew this boss fight was going to be stupid. Oh, 
Oh my god, this is going to look ridiculous. Oh my god, this stupid dog. Oh my god, I can't stand this fight. This is so ridiculous. I feel like I'm getting nowhere with this stupid fight. Good luck. Fuck you and the horse you rode on. Damien! Where is he? You're trying to trick me again with your lies. I know he's here. You took him from me. You have him! You got hurt, you fuck. Oh, I don't know what I'm doing. I'm just smashing buttons. Wait, is this how it ends? <coughs> Don't tell me this is how it ends. Half a ponytail is like in the fucking ground. Oh, there it comes out of the <laughs> <laughs> it's like a magic trick. I 
kind of sad. It's gonna make me tear up a little. Oh, she lost it. Fully now. Is that what you want me to believe? After all you've done to me? To him? You're not a lie. But you're a liar! You crawled into me. To confuse me and deceive me. But I know it's him. I know you have him. Standing, sitting there, kneeling there. I like this concept of Helena. More closer to the mythology aspect of it. And this is how it ends. That long ass journey to try to save our true love's soul. But well, there was no soul to save. But our own soul to save. I learned the hard way to not be afraid of death, Sarah. So. Why would it be with him? Because a life without loss is one without love. You turn your back on death, and all you can see is the shadow that it casts. The longer you hide from it, the longer the shadow grows until. I forgot my soda in the fridge. In the freezer. <laughs> when our time comes, we must look death in the eye and embrace it as a friend. Only then.
and emerge from that darkness. I'm gonna cry. We get to be together. Okay, I'll come down and grab some. <laughs> nebo, nebo. What's Helena doing? What the fuck? Never forget what it is like to see the world as a child suddenly. Every autumn leaf is like a work of art. Every rolling cloud a moving picture. Every day a new story. We too emerge from this magic, like a wave from the ocean, only to return to the sea. So she's learning to let go of all of her fear and hate. never leaves us. It is always there, waiting to be seen again. I'm hoping you voices are more helpful for Sun Law now, you fucking assholes. So she did defeat Helena. Oh, yeet. Even in the past two episodes, well, this episode and the other episode, I really didn't. I disliked the game because I didn't. I was being so salty. Uh, I'm happy I finished it. I'm happy I saw the ending. I didn't expect that to happen. Um, I'm happy. This. Give me a minute to get my thoughts together. I think this is a good way to... I think the story revolves around moving on from the hatred and all the things that happened to her in the past. The abuse from her father and watching her mother die and losing her one true love. So, I think this was... In a way, it was a hero's journey, learning to move past the mental illnesses that she faced too. Like schizophrenia, hearing voices. I believe that's says. Don't quote me on that. Actually, I'm not just hearing the voices. Let's call that um, hearing the voices and moving on and be able to live with it and not to be angry all James Chicken. <laughs> um, I'm not that great with these ending, like talking my feelings out for this. What I think of this 
game, but I liked it a lot in the end, even though I bitched and complained and was really salty at the end. But still, I enjoyed it. I don't regret it. And thank you all for watching. I hope you guys check this out if you haven't started checking out. This game is really fun. I can't wait for the second one that's coming out. So I decided to do some digging around in Hellblade to learn more of the lore because I do I really like this game even though I was really salty towards the end because of the fighting style it was still good I like the story behind it the cleverness of mental illness and I actually looked into it a little bit more it was it is psychos psycho psychosis which is something you should really look into it's a really interesting concept they mixed in with the Nordic mythology and actually Celtic mythology Senua is actually a Celtic warrior not a northman like i thought she was not a viking it was the vikings who are the northmen who came to invade her land and then cinema along with all this other stuff was dealing with like the mental illnesses she's fighting and stuff so i really like the game and i think they really did a good job of it and i can't wait for the second one that i heard might be coming out but thank you for watching, and I really suggest playing this game and, or looking into the mythology behind it because it's really cool. I like it a lot. And like I said, thank you again for watching, and I hope you guys have a good day.